Hey, this is Donna. I'm about to hit the streets. You can see me. You think I'm scared? From them beats? You think I'm scared that you're going to beat me down because of my, my voice? Because of what the fuck I say? I speak the truth? Give this phone a little time. I hope it come through clear, but when I, when I run them back through, they look clear. I don't know what's wrong, but this is, mm. oh, wow. You know, ladies, ah, uh, we got, you know how we get uh, lipstick on our teeth? Hey, 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 hey. But I, I feel you, MGTO, M-G-T-O-W. These bitches out here ain't shit. Y'all right. Don't fuck with these bitches. If they got two or more kids nowadays, they looking for a meal ticket. Don't fuck with none of these hoes. They trying to, if you a good guy or what they call a nerdy ass nigga, they think if they they blow your dome real good, you know what I'm saying, or give you some good punani that you're going to just be all in. Fuck these hoes. Wear, wear a condom and keep it moving. If you, you know... It's, it's so fucked up. Some shit I heard today from one of my spiritual sons who's a good guy. Handsome guy. Good guy. Every woman's dream type guy. As old as I am, Cougarville would be like, shit, I can't. Well, I can still have babies, but that's neither here nor there. But these, he's saying, mother, there's nobody out here. The, the young women he talked to, they just ain't about shit. Ladies, what's going on? If they're not telling me about your hygiene and you're smelling like fish and chips and white castle fish and chips and shit and onions, what's wrong with y'all? I know a lot of y'all mamas went about shit, especially you 80s and 90s baby. But the 80s babies, them 90s and 2000s, y'all babies done took the fuck over. Now, they wanna, they'd rather talk to a chick like this that's in her 50s and know that she's in her 50s. They know what she get. And they ain't lying. They good like an older woman. Uh, this older woman can't keep this tooth, this damn lipstick off her teeth. Damn. I know Elba, I'm jealous because he be wearing lipstick. That motherfucker paint his face up. He paint his face up so fucked up. Uh. Okay. That should do it. Shit. Until I get in the fucking car. I'm about to call up somebody I ain't talked to in a long time. If he don't answer me, then it's good. But I hope you answer and I catch you off guard. I just want to say hello, baby. You've been on my mind, and it's not bad and it's not good, but it's something that I, that dropped in my spirit about you. I just hope you're doing good and, and yours, you and yours. Something then it, it just dropped in my spirit, seriously. And nothing bad, nothing good. I wouldn't say if it was bad, but... Something that is bothering me about your spirit is something about you dropping in my spirit. And I don't be thinking about you like that. And you just dropped in there very heavily about three days ago. And I should have called then. I hope I don't hear nothing bad when I call. So if this is you, you know who I'm talking about. Make a troll account if it's you. And let me know. You know things that only we should know. Make a troll account and say something to let me know. Donna, I'm okay. Don't call. If I don't hear from you in about 24 hours, if you look at my channel, then I say he doesn't look at the channel. But if you do, just drop a, not trying to get attention from you, nothing like that, babe. It's just something dropped in my spirit about you that I, it, it didn't feel good. And I'm not trying to scare you and you are a, a great man of faith. But um, just let me know it's you by something that only me and you should know. If it's just one word, just mention one word. And if you mention that one word, you know I will know it's you. Just say, Donna, blah, blah. That's all you got to say. And I ain't going to tell you what to say or what to say or how to name it. But if you, you, if you name just one word, I'll know it's you, babe. I'll know it's you. Just let me know you okay, baby. I do miss you. I miss you a lot. But I done got over it. I miss you. I miss my friend. I do that with a 
with my head, with my hat nod. But I'm gonna put it back up. You were so sweet, so kind, so so generous, and you showed me. But it was, you know what I'm saying. I'm not, I'm not gonna put our business out there. But you really showed me some things, and I and you allowed me to see your soul and your spirit. And um, I hope everything is well with you, and you know what what's attached to you. And that's all I'm gonna say. Yeah, I, I'm not going to put you out there, babe, like that. You never put me out there either. And I miss you. I do. But I just miss, like, can I just hear from him, like, once a month or every two months? Just to let me know he's okay. Because I got the numbers. I got the info. I got the addresses. I got all that. And you know, working for the state, I could go even further. But I don't. But I can. And I have. Even thought about mailing you a letter, a certified letter that you had to sign for. But I said, no, I don't want him to think anything other than like that. Because I know how you respect your privacy. And I know what kind of, you're very mature. And I really, you know, I, that's one of the things that I admire about you. So feel, whether you feel special or not, just know I'm talking to you. Forgive the coloring and the lighting on this burnout. But baby, I miss you. I do. Not in that other way. I miss you knowing that you're okay. I just want to know if you're okay, baby. That's all. That's all. <coughs> <coughs> Coughing like roach stop. But baby, just know you left a lasting impression on me because of your soul and your spirit. And you ain't shit. Now, you know I'm joking, right? I've said that shit to you in your face. Say that to you in one breath and you know what else. Miss you, babe.